What's up guys, this is iTweaks here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you how to use iOS 8's new photo editing tools. So first all we need to do is just jump into our photos app and let's say that we wanted to edit this photo. So we're just going to tap on edit right up here in the top right hand corner and then right up here in the top right hand corner again we have a wand. So this is going to be one of those one tap fixes all sort of things. So if we tap on that you can see that it kind of changes up the lighting and everything right there. But if you want to do this manually then they give you quite a bit of tools that you can use uh, to do that. So if we tap on the crop button right here you can see that my picture is actually a little bit crooked. So we're going to straighten that up just by sliding just like that. So that should be pretty level as you can see right there and it's going to automatically crop that. Now if we didn't want to use that and we wanted to maybe just turn the entire picture 90 degrees then we can just tap right here and you can see that how that turns 90 degrees each time you tap that. You can also change the aspect ratio if you want to do so right here. So if we want to do square then you can see there's a square we can go back to the original which we're gonna stick at for right now and then right here we have all of our filters that you can go through you have your mono tonal noir fade chrome process I mean here are all your your uh, filters right here and then here are some other new features that you have first let's go ahead and change this back to the original filter right here so we can see what the difference is so we have light color and black and white so if we tap on light you can see if we slide across that it's going to automatically change a bunch of different things and make that photo actually brighter. So if we wanted to see what it was doing on a granular level, we can just tap on this right here and you can see when we slide across, it's going to change the exposure, highlight, shadows, brightness, contrast, and black point. So we're gonna tap off of this and just to show you if we move this across, you can see what type of changes that it's actually making. Now if you want to change that on a granular level then you can just tap on one of these and then change the exposure all by itself. So when we go back you can see the exposure has changed but nothing else has changed. Now we can also do the exact same thing with color so if we wanted to make the color a little bit more green so it's going to be a little bit more contrast you can see that you can just slide that over again on a granular level you can go to saturation contrast and cast right here you can change that up depending on what you want it to look like and then we have black and white so you can slide this across right here and you can see it's basically changing that exposure level it actually looks kind of creepy almost looks like it's uh snowing there but you can see what that does again if we tap on that you can change up the intensity neutrals tone and grain so that's a quick rundown of how to use all the photo editing tools in ios 8. let me know what you think about this feature in the comments below and if you enjoyed this video please hit that like button if you want to see more of my videos then go ahead and subscribe all right guys until next time this is iTweaks with iphonehacks.com